Hello everybody, um, I finally managed to make another video and uh, this time it's about the one morning I went out to photograph the early morning mist that was outside. Oh man, it finally is foggy out. I've been waiting so long for some fog out here. Um, I remember being really excited to go out and uh, really excited about the fog because I haven't experienced that heavy fog in a long time. <laughs> so dark, man. Found this lonely road. It's kind of simple, and I like simple pictures where there isn't much going on. Get down to maybe two seconds. Yeah. Like that. Oh, it moved so bad. Yeah, at this point it was already very bright outside and uh, that blue morning light, that mystic blue morning light was gone. Um, so I made my way back home. A lonely office chair in the middle of the field. Okay, so since I've still um, some shots left on the roll, I've decided to go out and take some long exposures at night. Um, yeah, let's see how this goes. Yeah, the reason I sound so skeptic uh, is because I haven't had that much luck with taking long exposures in the past. The subject I had in mind uh, were these two trailers um, in the middle of an the abandoned parking lot. Um, I found them earlier 
and uh, thought it would be a very good idea to take pictures of them at night. Well, there they are. started raining again so I have to be a little bit quicker than usual another part that made uh, everything a little bit more challenging was that I tried to artificially light the whole scene for the first time um, that's why I brought this cheap LED panel and uh, put it behind the trailers Yeah, this is something I haven't tried before, so another part of the puzzle that uh, made everything a little bit more complicated, especially um, the exposure side of things. Yeah, and as you can see, I failed again unfortunately the pictures came out pretty underexposed uh, especially the dark parts of the image were way too dark i think the led panel was set too bright and uh, created too much contrast for the film to handle maybe setting it a little bit less bright and um, uh, bumping up the exposure time a lot would have created a lot more even exposure of the whole image. This is it. The full roll. Okay. Because I wasn't trusting my uh, exposures on film, I uh, took some backup photos on my digital camera as well and they turned out much better so not everything went bad Yeah, this is it. Um, another roll of Kodak Portra 400. Uh, this time shot into very different environments. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, that's it, I guess. Thanks for watching. <laughs>